They say a church is a building. It is not a building, rather. It's the people. And today, despite the rain, the people came together to build the foundation for a new place of worship, building a church in a day from scratch. Every nail through the framework, every single cut and measurement, a labor of love. These guys love God. Well, they come from everywhere and uh, they volunteer. All of the labor that you see here, these people have all volunteered to help. Rain or shine, volunteers give their labor, time, and energy to help raise the walls for a place of worship. It's an adrenaline rush. It's a lot of fun. Stephen Northcutt came to Hazlitt all the way from Indiana, using his skills to give back, though he says he's received something priceless in return. I met my wife in 2003 at a church in the day in Indiana. And this is nearly his 40th church in a day project. The program is sponsored by the United Pentecostal Church International. As the name implies, they've got a tight deadline. Sunday afternoon, 2 o'clock, we'll be having service here at Hazlitt. The barn raising was moved up from Friday because of the weather. By Sunday, these four corners will become a church. A 1,566 square foot building complete with an auditorium, seating for 90 people, and three Sunday school classrooms. It will be a comfortable place for the Grace Point Church to come together. A congregation, 40 strong, that started meeting in a house and that will soon call this space home. My hopes and dreams is that we can either grow, impact this community. Now, this is the 137th church in the country that the program has built.